Back here on the corner. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's so a wide one. Thank you. Um, okay, can you back up this church? All right. <coughs> this was James Wagner's home? Still is. Still is. Oh, yeah. thanks. And there's a flood site. Now, notice how low it is. We're only a block from the railroad track. So this is where the, the river was finally petering out. It did not cross the railroad track. So this was about as close as you would be, and they only had water on the first floor. The people along here were able to get things up to the second floor. And back then, nobody had wall-to-wall -wall carpet. So you rolled up the carpet and you took it upstairs. Uh, most of the furniture was relatively portable. The only thing they had trouble with was pianos, and nobody could move their piano up to the second floor. So he was a former postmaster until he retired from that job. And um, I think they said that is about five feet, however they were uh, measuring flood levels. This is the five foot. All right, now we're going back to the bus stop. Do you know how to do that from here? The train station uh, was right at the edge of, of the water, so they would have had it lapping at its feet, but not necessarily in the building. Now, when we get off the bus, we're supposed to look down at Bullwinkles. Uh, I'm not, I'm not going to make any of you walk down there unless you want to. There is a flood sign inside, uh, not on the outside, but there is one on the inside. That building dates back to 1848, and it was built by a man named Joseph Schwarztraubel. That name familiar to anybody? That was a new one for me, Schwarztraubel. Um, <laughs> some of the things that happened there, so he was a stone uh, mason. He had foundations, he made uh, foundations for buildings. He had curbs and pavements. It was the saloon by 1873. During Prohibition, they brought the whiskey in in a baby carriage. <laughs> so even during the Prohibition, Bullwinkles had the good stuff. <laughs> okay, so remember that down at B&B are some free refreshments if you're interested. They didn't tell me what it is, but free isn't bad. <laughs> Good price. So thank you for joining us. Thank you. Oh my thank, you. Uh -oh. thank you very much. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Thank you. <clears throat> 